So you asked about why the church is purple and the symbolism behind that. Purple is a color that has often been used by women's movements and ancient religious traditions. I think it was in 2007 or 8 that we would paint the church purple and periwinkle. It was painted beige, it was beige the whole time. And after we painted it purple, there were a few folks said, oh, there's a church there. Primarily, it started out with women being drawn here who could feel safe in a, a setting where they could express how they relate to their own spirituality as well as what they would like in a community. Also, people who connect the arts with their spiritual life. And that is what, what our spiritual life is uh, in a variety of ways. It's not just reading a particular textbook and having someone analyze it for you. All of our artwork now is done by members of the community who are by friends of the congregation. I have found that people will come in and meditate with the imagery. We also have in our community people who write poetry. Our musicians write pieces of music. There's all kinds of things besides paintings. And we read a book now or two too. But the visualization it, uh, is a way of connecting. We say the underlying thread that brings us together is lifting up the divine feminine in self, in world, in justice. But we stay connected on purpose to the Lutheran Church of which this congregation has grown out of. We feel that there are signs within Christianity, first of all, that point to a very expansive understanding of the divine and God. But we also stay in, in that tradition because there are folks that we hope, not just women, but folks who are longing for something more than what their patriarchal uh, religious traditions have to author and give, but don't know where to go or don't know what to try or don't want something to be so unfamiliar.